go ahead. Breakfast, lunch, snacks, even dinner. Last school year, the Orange County School District served 38 million meals, more than Disney and Universal Studios combined. And when it comes to OCPS, full tummies leads to full minds. If a student has, you know, a, a nutritious meal every day, they learn better. They have less disciplinary actions, you know, in, in the schools. Um, you know, they focus better. Even when they go home, it's, it's better for them. But there's some key information parents need to know to make sure their child is in the right meal program. If your child qualifies for the free and reduced meal benefits program, you need to fill out the application and you need to do it right away. Since the USDA waiver is expired, um, we have to go back to uh, what's called a meal status uh, where we get free, reduced or paid. Um, they have to fill out the application and we would like those parents to know that we need those to fill out those applications as soon as possible. 73 schools are impacted by that waiver change. You need to fill out the application by September, otherwise you might get stuck paying full price. That application also leads to other benefits like waivers for SAT, ACT exams, and college application fees, even discounted internet service. The district, meanwhile, is also taking on a bigger financial burden this year. Children on free or reduced meals will not have to pay. You know, parents, rent's going up tremendously. So we're trying to help these parents and help these families get through this, this period. So for us raising prices right now, it's not beneficial for our parents of Orange County Public Schools. There are also 154 schools in the district called Community Eligibility Provision Schools, or CEP. At those schools, your child is automatically eligible for free breakfast and lunch. Every student at that school eats at no charge, and they don't have to fill out an application at those schools. However, if you are transferring from a school that's not on the community eligibility program, you will have to fill out an application. This year, with prices on everything going up, the district wants parents to know they're here to help. Their top priority is making sure children can focus on learning and not worry about their next meal. Because for OCPS, it's quite literally food for thought. That's why we offer you know, breakfast, lunch, snack, and, and supper at a lot of schools. So. This is what we try to do. We try to take that burden off the family because, you know, if they eat at our schools, they don't have to buy those groceries at home and they can put that to other things.